Hello everyone, welcome to Engineering Classes YouTube channel for a video lecture series in Python. In this video lecture, we'll consider the question explain the following methods in lists with examples 1 len, 2 sum, 3 max, 4 min. So, without wasting much time, let's get into the concept straight away. First, let me consider len. The len function is used to find the length of the list. So basically, the len function is used to find the length of the list. It counts the number of values that are present in a list and returns a integer value. So what it does basically is it counts the number of values that are present in a list and it returns an integer value. To understand this much better, enter the following into the interactive shell. Yes, this is the interactive shell of the Python. Let me first define a a list spam is a list variable spam is equal to it is defined as cat dog and let me consider another as rat so these are the three elements three values of the list and if I want to find the length of this list so I would write I would type len bracket spam so if I do that there are three elements and if I press enter I'm going to get three as my output similarly let me consider another example uh, this time I would define another uh, list with the uh, variable name spam1 equal to this time I would con consider 10 20 30 40 50 so these are the five elements present in a list and if I want to uh, find the length of such a list I would uh, type len into bracket spam 1 so if I do this I'm going to get its length as 5 so this is the explanation of len function in list next let me consider the second method that is sum the sum function is used to find the sum or total of the values present in a list uh, let us consider uh, the syntax for this sum into bracket list comma start we'll understand what the list is and what the start is list it is the defined list with the values what is start this start is added to the sum of numbers in the list if the start is not given in the syntax then it is assumed to be zero so this is very important if the start is not specified it is assumed to be zero to understand this much better and enter the uh, following into the interactive shell yes this is the interactive shell of python first let me define a list spam equal to spam is a list variable which is equal to 1 comma 2 comma 3 comma 4 so this is our list now i want to find I want to demonstrate sum so let me type sum into bracket spam so if I do this it is going to count uh, the values that are present in spam 1 plus 2 is 3 3 plus 3 is 6 6 plus 4 is 10 so first I'm trying to demonstrate sum with no start value so I would get the answer as 10 so for the same thing let me consider sum into bracket spam this is the list so now I would uh, specify the start value as 5 I would get 10 plus 5 as 15 as the answer let me check the same with Python so if I press enter I'm going to get 15 as the answer so this is the demonstration of some method of the list now let me consider the third method that is max the max function in Python finds and returns the largest element in the list so what we have to do is first we have to define a list uh, with the elements and the max function will find the largest element and it returns the lar largest element in the list uh, if we consider the syntax so I have to use max as the keyword inside the bracket I have to specify the list name wherein the list name is the name of the list uh, that needs to be defined to understand this much better enter the following into the interactive shell yes this is the interactive shell of python here let me consider the demonstration of max function first let me uh, define a list 
spam is the name of the variable which holds the list spam is equal to 2 comma 4 comma minus 4 comma 7 comma 9 so this is the defined list in this list I want to find the largest element for that I have to use the keyword max and inside the bracket I have to specify the name of the list so here it is being named as spam so max of spam if I type this and press enter I'm going to get the largest element of this list which is 9 so this is the demonstration of max function moving on further now let me consider the fourth method that is min function the min function in Python finds and returns the smallest element in the list so for example we have got a list in that list uh, min function finds and returns the smallest element if I consider the syntax syntax is going to be min inside the bracket list name whereas min is the keyword and list name is the name of the list that is being defined to understand this much better enter the following into the interactive shell yes this is the interactive shell of python let me now consider the demonstration of min function for that let me first define a list it's been named as a spam so inside i'm going to have the elements 2 comma 3 comma 4 comma minus 4 minus 1 then let me have minus 4 comma 0 comma 6 yes this is the list being uh, defined and in this list I want to find the smallest element for this I have to use min inside the bracket I have to type spam which is the name of the list if I press enter I'm going to get the smallest element that present in the list which is minus 4 yes this is the demonstration of min function in python yes with this we have considered uh, uh, the definition of four methods and the demonstration of four methods i hope you people have understood if there are still any doubts please let me know them onto the comment section and i'm happy to answer those doubts thank you so much for watching